Hi guys, it's Game That Back here with a, another career mode video, and this is the Luton Town career mode. And as you can see, up here we are 10 games into the league season so far. Next game up is at Liverpool, going to be a very, very difficult one for us to play this one. Um, they are literally a basically a few positions above us, but quite a few points above us, which is you know the main thing if we could get a win here it'd be great but it's going to be very difficult we've got liverpool then united up next we're in third very happy with our league position to be honest eighth position is more than what i was expecting pushing towards a european spot of some sort would be massive if we could get that but let's go ahead and show you the calendar show you what i'm looking at so we've got liverpool man united palace uh, brentford arsenal man city bournemouth chelsea in the cup Newcastle, Sheffield United and Chelsea yet again there. So what I want to do is I'm going to probably quick in this Liverpool game, play the United game at Old Trafford because that sounds like a lot of fun and then uh, might play a, another game here of some sort. I might play the Cup game because I'm quite interested in getting far in the Cup. Then maybe we will play one of these lower league sides if we need to because to be honest, they are the teams I need to be beating, not the Arsenals, the Cities, the Chelsea's and all that lot. They're not the teams I need to beat. But if you guys are enjoying this series and are going to like the episode, please smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and hit that notification bell, all those lovely things. And let's go ahead and show you how the team has been performing as well so far. So in the squad hub, we have stats-wise, we have Enketia here with six goals, three assists in 10 games. Very happy with that. Usabri Hall doing a great job with four goals and seven assists. Ross Barkley, three goals, one assist. And the same with Halibo off the bench and in the reserve squad. Smith Rowe probably needs to step up a little bit more, but we, he does have a time. Also, Chong with uh, chipping in with two goals there from the bench, which is a very nice to see. So let's uh, also, guys, if you start can start thinking about um, who we do want to bring in in the January transfer. Now, if anyone got 11 million, us obviously, um, you know, we could swap a player over. I guess if we need to, we do have a few players we could slightly get rid of. Maybe Bore is going to probably go back. So probably might need to look at getting a new right back to replace him as on, on the reserve side really because um, yeah I imagine he'll be going back soon because we're not playing him enough and City will end up recalling him I'm sure of that. But with all that guys let's go ahead get into these games and see how we can get going let's do it. And here we go guys quick sim this game against Liverpool and we've gone ahead and got a 0-0 draw I'll take that at home. Uh, Chavez and Lockyer getting um, yellow cards. Juice Brickle coming off for Encamba and King coming on for Doherty. Definitely take that before this United game. Let's keep going. Okay, then, guys, here we are at Old Trafford to play a Manchester United. Anthony in form, apparently, three goals from three games. But this is a game we want to go out, try and get ourselves some points. Going to be tough, but let's see if we can get it done. Oh, and he's doing well here. Oh, and that is a great block. Pazunu does well. That is very well played. And a good block again. Oh, we get it out really nicely. Now, we do have the break going here. Barkley. Oh, he sees Chavez again. That is superbly played. Chavez. Can we knock it across to Smith Rowe? And that is a great counter-attack. Man United press so hard hit them on the counter attack we're just keeping our call at the back and playing the ball out Chavez here could have went for the shot just plays the clever ball and Smith Rowe there to tap in past Dunano had no chance there what a start to this game very very happy the way the team is defending there and great break 20 minutes gone one nil up massive massive goal let's keep going me there oh that is so poor I have to do better Hoyland now Hoyland's round the back can we do this oh Hoyland's gone for the goal and that one nearly snuck in oh we did just play it out very very tough there oh we've got to try and get the block in and oh great tap great great block by Bazunu and they play him back for the free kick 
Oh, come on. We need to get someone on the line here because they're going to go in for the goal here. And he's going for it. And, oh, it's off the post. Man United coming back at us here. Got to watch this. Now chasing him down. Oh, he's done well. Now again, oh, he's played it through to Ross Barkley. In on goal. Great save by Onana there. 40th minute. That was so, so close to making that 2-0. Now Smith Rowe. Smith Rowe here. He's going to hit it. Oh, that's just wide. That was so close by Emil Smith Rowe there. Oh, he's chipped up over to Hoyland really well. Oh, he don't did it that way really nicely. Oh, and we were on the counter again. But going into half time, guys, 1 0 up. What a tough game. Very back and forth. They've had chances, we've had chances, but we have got that one goal going into half time. So let's go ahead, get into the second half, see if we can keep this up. Now let's go. to Ross Barkley. Plays it back to Inketia. Oh, and he's out for a corner there. Not quite the way we wanted to do it. And plays one short again. Oh, he plays it back out to Sambi Lakonga. Oh, he sees that ball. Oh, he's in here by Dewsbury Hall. Dewsbury Hall, what a strike. What a hit. And he has absolutely smashed that top of the goal. And it's 2-0, guys. What a big goal. And we are pushing now <laughs> against teams we did not expect. It. This Man United side's just fallen apart. On the attack, very good, but... In defence, Harry Maguire is not the one. Unana had no chance with that hit. Just given so much face. And what a strike. Unana dived the wrong way, to be honest, guys. I think he thought we were going near post. But what a goal. 2-0 up. Let's go. Lovely defence. Now, Chavez sees it through into Inketia, who is through here. Against Harry Maguire. Against Harry Maguire. Plays it back. Still got the ball. Ross Barkley plays it out to Smith Rowe. Smith Rowe, we're just playing it around really nicely. Oh, oh, he's through. Oh, he's done so well. Can he play it across to Inketia in front of the goal? What a finish. And we are freeing up here, guys. What are United doing in defence? They're just falling asleep. And we are making them pay. They thought they got the tackling on me here, but that is a lovely move in there. And Nketia just past Maguire. He's having an absolute nightmare. Going to make a few substitutes now, guys. 3-0 up. What a game. <laughs> Get in there. Now, sees that ball through to Nketia. Nketia running through on goal. Nketia going to whip it back to Dewsbury Hall. Can't get to it. Oh, and that is out of play. 3-0 here, guys. What a victory for this Luton Town squad. Oh, they're just getting better and better. And this is probably the best of them all so far. United were terrible here. Going forward, very good. But in defence, Harry Maguire had an absolute nightmare. That guy there had a nightmare against our uh, forward team. Looks terrible. What a victory. Let's keep going. Okay then, guys. Next game we had against Crystal Palace. Quick sim this one. We got a 1-0 win with Enketia in the 81st minute getting a big goal for us. So we are on a winning streak here. Very happy to see that. Let's keep going. Okay, guys, so next game up, we go ahead and get a 1-1 draw against Brentford. Not quite the result we wanted, but uh, in Buermo on the 89th minute, getting a goal. Smith Row for us as well. Not quite, but let's keep going. Okay, then, guys, next game up here at Kernelworth Road against Arsenal here in Ketia. Bans his own cl old club, Smith Row against his old club here. And this is a team that is just below us in the table, guys, so we need... To keep up, uh, you know, keep them away from us here. Obviously, Arsenal should be further up in the table. But we want to keep them away. At Kenilworth Road, it's going to be very difficult for them. This is a tough place to come. And teams do not like coming here. We are on very good form. So, let's go out there and show them what we're made of. Let's do it. Down. Oh, Saka inside. 
Oh, and again, that is a great, great block, uh, interception there by Brathwaite. Now we keep coming forward. Oh, done well. Oh, that's a great tackle. Now to Ross Barkley, back inside to Dewsbury Hall. Oh, through to Enketia there, guys. What a goal. What a brilliant play by this team. And Enketia has scored against his old club, and he's celebrating, guys. Probably shouldn't be celebrating. He's not going too crazy here. All the players around him. But that is a brilliant ball there by Barkley. What a pass and what a finish. Near post, no miss in there. Inketia against his former club getting a brilliant brilliant goal what a start to this game Arsenal broke basically just play outplayed there that is superb by Barkley 1-0 let's keep going oh Lukonga this guy loves a tackle Oh, plays it through to Enketia again. Enketia again. Enketia again. Oh, and he has just scored another great goal. We don't want to celebrate too much. But there we go, guys. What a brilliant finish by Eddie Enketia. Showing what he is made of. That is a brilliant ball again there. And Enketia, what a strike past Ramsdale. He couldn't have placed that any better to beat the goalkeeper. And he is really showing why Arsenal should not let him go here. 2-0. What a game. Giles on the wing. And it is half time. 2-0 here, guys. And what a game we have played. It's just the blocks. Getting the players in the right position to make these blocks in front of goal. has been superb by this team. Got to say that. And the finishing from Nketiah has been emphatic. What a game so far. Let's keep going. Plays it forward early. And again, Enketia. Oh, Enketia's turned so well. Enketia. Enketia. Oh, and he was going for his hat trick there. He's lively up. Just not quite. Oh, got to watch it here. Oh, got to watch. The, they do have the ball here with Gabriel Jesus in the box. Oh, and Pazunu has been beaten and just could not block it off. Martinelli with the goal. 2-1. Trying to get round the opposite side of Gabriel Jesus here with the defender. Just couldn't get there. Missed it. And Martinelli smashes it past Pazunu. Just couldn't get enough of a strong hand to it. Let's see if we can keep this up now. Giles. Oh, he's played it through. That is superb to Dewsbury Hall. Out to Smith Rowe here against his former club. Smith Rowe. Oh, and he's got straight back in it. Emil Smith Rowe here with the goal. Gets a superb finish. And we've come straight down the other end after them scoring. They've just gone to sleep. It's just a simple pass. Dewsbury Hall. And then Smith Rowe with the finish here. The player not getting back to it. And that's a great finish, by the way, guys. 3-1. Let's keep going. Forward to Smith Rowe. Plays the ball forward to Nketiah. Oh, that is a brutal ball through to Ross Barkley. Plays it back to Nketiah. Oh, for his hat-trick. And it's a good save by Ramsdale. We are hitting very well on the counter here. Load of substitutes coming on. Very happy with the squad. Smith Rowe coming off. Can we do anything with this team that's just come on? We have this now. Now, Joe Bellingham with the strike. Don't try to get it. Hits in Ketia there. Arsenal have to make the moves now. Now, down the wings. Oh, they're playing the ball around really nicely now. Martinelli. Oh, it's a great block by Doty. Oh, and again, still Doty. He's done so well. Now playing it forward to Enketia. Enketia still going. Enketia. Oh, come on. He's trying for that hat trick. Just cannot make it. Played it. Played it short. Plays it out to Chong. Going to hit it. Oh, Joe Bellingham. And that's fallen for him. And Chong, Joe Bellingham with the strike makes it 4-1 and that is game over what a strike by the youngster 
that is what he really needed that goal Chong smashed it, it's deflected off and fallen straight to Job here and he has no problem in smashing that past Ramsdale there great finish and no chance there for the keeper this is a big 4-1 win guys what a game and this team is looking ridiculous now and there we go guys big 4-1 win at Kenilworth Road these teams they really do press very hard but because we've been defending so well it's given us such a great opportunity the passing in this squad has been the difference and the defensive prowess of all the midfielders has made this team so strong two goals for Eddie Nketiah great game great great finish to it let's go okay then Kai's decided to quick sim this one because you know these are teams that I'm going to struggle to beat and we got a 3-1 loss our undefeated run has stopped here and Ketia got himself another goal which is good to see Grealish Haaland and Alvarez got the goals for them they got a red card that is disappointing to get that loss still but Man City are in the next level they're going to be hard to beat let's go ahead show you what we're looking like in the table so far let's keep going okay then guys so before we go any further this is what we are looking like at the moment we are in eighth position only a few points behind everton and not even only five points behind spurs and liverpool so we do have a great opportunity of going ahead and doing something in the league this season maybe getting some european football which would be great to see uh you know it's very very tight bottom of the table you've got uh, uh, Bournemouth, Sheffield and Burnley down there Nottingham Forest, Brentford these teams are struggling but we are high flying at the moment thanks to the signings we have brought in basically a load of Arsenal sort of rejects as sort of, really if you think about it this is a team of Arsenal players that just aren't you know getting into the team in real life in Ketia here 11 goals 3 assists we've got Dewsbury Hall from Leicester you know Five goals, ten assists, what a great play. Smith Rowe, five and two. Another one that just wasn't doing the job. You know, he's not getting any chances at Arsenal, really. Ross Barkley doing a great job. Adebayo again. And got a bit of a big shout out to this guy here. He doesn't get any goals or assists. Sambi Lakonga, guys. In the middle of the park. Oh my word. He makes so many tackles that lead to goals. It's unreal. I've probably said it a few times as we've been playing this game but he just makes so many big tackles and that's why we've been keeping so many clean sheet guys because this guy makes the tackles passes on to the likes of Barkley or Dewsbury Hall that make the assists for Inketia. he is next level same with Chavez he does a lot of running guys been great for us since he's come in he's only got one assist but the amount of running he does to get into the clear is unreal what a player and Bazunu we gotta give him a shout out six clean sheets for this Lewin side since he's come in um you know that is crazy because you know you don't expect it with the you know the level of players we've got you know 74 rate like 274 rated defenders are 70 and 276s and he's only 72 rated himself guys so very happy with the way the team is performing at the moment we have Bournemouth up next, going to quick sim that, going to play this Chelsea game um, uh, with the reserve side in the highlights and then we're going to get through this Newcastle, Sheffield United and Chelsea game, might even do a played highlights of one of them before we finish and then we're into January where we have MK Dons in the FA Cup and yeah, then we start looking at January transfer window then, so let's go ahead, get into this Bournemouth game and see what we can get done and there we go guys that is the result we was expecting a big 3-0 win against Bournemouth for the bottom of the table Barkley Giles and Barkley with two goals brilliant win let's go ahead get into this Chelsea game in the car let's see when we get done okay then guys we are here in this game against Chelsea in the uh, league cup the uh, Carabao cup here and we are going ahead playing with our reserve side Let's see if we can get a big win here. Let's go. Okay, Chelsea with a chance here. Good save by Kaminsky. Oh, now Chong here. Going to play it short here to Dewsbury Hall on 
from off the bench. Hits it. What a strike by Dewsbury Hall with off the bench. And he's absolutely rifled it. This is what this guy can do. What a strike from the corner. And this is the difference between this side and the old one. This guy is unreal. Let's keep going. It's sixth minute here now. And we have Chelsea coming forward with the ball. Need to defend well here. So close to making a very big victory to take us through to a cup semi-final here. Thanks to a rocket Dewsbury Hall goal. Oh, brilliant, brilliant. Direct tackle. And there we go, guys. A 1-0 win thanks to a Dewsbury Hall absolute rocket of a shot. And we are in the semi-finals here, guys. That guy there is just unreal. So pleased with this signing. He has been superb for us. One tent, one goal, and that's all we needed. Let's go ahead. Let's see if we get in the semi-finals. Let's keep going. Okay, then, guys, our next opponent in the Carabao Cup semi-final is Manchester City. Two legs to try and get past them. It's going to be so difficult. But if we do get through that, we got Newcastle or Sheffield United in the final. So that is a more achievable, uh, basically, goal there. But we've got Newcastle up next, then Sheffield United, and then Chelsea yet again in the league. I'm going to go ahead, quick sim these games. Get into January, obviously. We have the FA Cup against Dons, and then two massive legs against City. And then, yeah. Brilliant, brilliant. The next episode is going to be absolutely mad. Crazy one, but Dewsbury Hall getting us there with that a crazy finish yet again. Let's go ahead, get into this Newcastle game, see how we get on. And next game up, guys, we get a 3-3 free, free draw against Newcastle. Dewsbury Hall yet again. Smith Rowe and Giles with the goals. Gordon Ritchie and Bruno for them. That is a decent result against a very tough Newcastle side. Let's take that. Let's keep moving. And there we go, guys. This was a huge victory for us against Sheffield United. 2-1. Ross Barkley off the bench. Didn't start because he was tied. And Nketiah with the goals. Um, Sambi Lekonga coming off. Brewster for them. But this is a huge win. Wanted to keep the pressure on. And these are the teams we need to be beating. 2-1. Let's keep going. And there we go, guys. This is a, another massive sim win here. 1-0 win against Chelsea, who are in second position, by the way, guys. Added by who I brought him, I put him in instead of Barkley because Barkley was shattered. And he's got that goal, ninth minute. And we've held on yet again. Another clean sheet from this squad. They are playing unreal at the moment. So happy with the squad. 1-0. Let's get into January transfer window. Let's do it. Okay, guys, so going into January here, and Kabore has gone back to Manchester City, as you can see. So, basically, we are going to have to go ahead and bring in a new backup right back here for Do instead of Doty, uh, because, um, yeah, our squad will be absolutely exhausted if we keep playing like that. Don't really have the players and the amount of players to be able to do it King's struggling okay and he's playing a lot of games at the moment to be fair to him but need to go ahead and bring one in I have got a few people here on the transfer list here Max Aarons uh, Lamperty Lamperty might be a starter rather than sitting on the bench but this guy Max Aarons could be an option here um, generally decent rate should be cheap we also have Alistair Johnston here from Celtic, who's playing very well in real life for them. Um, so could bring him in again, might be a more of a starter rather than anything, but we do have them options. Let me know down below if there's any uh, players you think I should bring in in that position. I do have only £11 million to play with, so yeah, need to please get your ideas in there, guys. But we have MK Dons up next and uh, in the FA Cup. So going to go ahead and uh, basically quick sim that game. That'll finish this episode and then we will see what we are working with. Let's go. And there we go with the reserve side guys and get a 1-0 win at the MK Dons. Um, Adebo with him so getting himself yet another goal. Good to see. Really needed a decent win here and we've done it through to the next round. Let's see what we get. 
Okay guys, that is the end of this episode and as you can see we've had a very very good one here obviously in the uh, Carabao Cup semi-finals here. Let me go ahead and show you where we are in the league as well and we are sitting in seventh position here. Uh, nine wins, eight draws, three losses. Brilliant, brilliant start to the season guys. The only team, there's not many teams that have had um, less basically losses than us um we've got west ham on three liverpool on two uh and man city on one it's just we've been picking up a lot of draws but you know we're not going to complain about that we are in seventh position we're in that european spots around that area but the arsenal there and aston villa and newcastle um so these this is you know we couldn't have dreamt for anything more than this and obviously fa cup we did go through to the next round and we got replays to play, so we can't see that. And then obviously Carabao Cup, we've got Man City, two legs there, Newcastle, Sheffield United, the other side. To said we only have 11 million to play with here, and I've done a couple of offers already. Max Aaron's I can get in for, um, what was it? Uh, I offered, what was it? How much do we offer out here? Six million for Max Aaron's. We have 6.2 here for Lamperty and van der Beek I got for 5.5 here had an idea about this guys because obviously Ross Barkley is definitely aging and not you know he's not going to get any younger bring him in maybe put him in that can position we do have Dewsbury Hall um again he is a crazy player to have around but I think about probably putting van der Beek in there as Ross Barkley does start to drop off at the moment happy with him but i think it would be another great player to stick in this midfield here obviously very light on numbers um and obviously right back position we need a backup here so we do have the likes of lamberty and um yeah uh, lamberty and um, max aaron's there for an option so please let me know in the comments down below if there's any players you can think of um to bring in instead um, but we'll wait for your input. But with all that, guys, I am Gamer Dad out. Cheers. Peace. Bye.